Antoinette, he certainly is. The White House, Pentagon, and State Department are said to be furious. That's because this trip was not authorized and may have distracted personnel carrying out the evacuations of Americans and allies in Kabul. Now, the congressman released a statement that reads, in part, as a member of Congress, we have a duty to provide oversight on the executive branch. We conducted this visit in secret, seek, speaking about it only after our departure to minimize the risk and disruption to the people on the ground and because we were there to gather information, not to grandstand. Moulton is calling on President Biden to extend his August 31st deadline for pulling troops out of Afghanistan. He says the U.S. will not get everyone out in time. The president has asked the Pentagon and State Department for contingency plans to adjust that timetable. The completion by August 31st depends upon the Taliban continuing to cooperate and allow access to the airport for those who were, trans were transporting out and no disruptions to our operations. Now, the president says more than 70,000 people have been evacuated from Afghanistan since August 14th. President Biden met yesterday with the top G7 allies who also reportedly urged President Biden to extend that deadline, that timetable rather, for evacuations. In Charlestown, Matt Reed, WCVB News Center 5.